aren't you tired of the drama? You use your words like they are knives mm -hmm. I don't need that type of drama And trying to be tough all the day time Make yourself feel better by taking me down Once I fell, but now I'm strong I'm ready for the rematch Shoot me down, don't you know Looking at me so cold Get over yourself, are you for real? Mm -hmm. Why are you looking at me so cold? One's love is now we're enemies Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another What I Eat in a Day video. So, just to let you guys know, if you are new here, I am on a journey currently to lose over 100 pounds and I am currently following the WW, or what was formerly known as Weight Watchers Purple Plan. So, I showed a little snippet of me making some breakfast. This is one of my absolute most favorite breakfasts. It's so delicious. It is seven points in total, so I'll show you the like breakdown of the points and everything but let me turn you around and show you in detail all that is included in here it is absolutely delicious i am starving so i'm very much so looking forward to digging into this okay so here's breakfast i've got a couple clementines for zero points i have two eggs for zero points i have two slices of hormel fully cooked bacon it's one point per slice so that's two points and then i've got 42 grams of avocado on there and that is two points and then the Trader Joe's sourdough bread is three points so in total this is a seven point breakfast normally my breakfasts are not that high but it is about what time is it it is 10 47 so I will probably just have a little snack between this meal and dinner and yeah, so I have some points to spare. So I figured I might as well, you know, kind of have a little bit of a heartier breakfast. But yeah, so this is what I am eating right now. And then I will check back in with you guys when it is snack time or meal two time. I'm not super sure what that's going to end up being yet. I have been using my 52 week meal planner that I have right here to plan out my meals. I am super flexible with this, however, like for example, today, I originally had a veggie scramble listed for today for zero points, but I'm getting a later start to my day. I know that dinner tonight is going to be um, eight points in total, and I've got two points left over, so that gives me about 11 points to work with between breakfast and lunch, so, I can have a little snack for four points in between this meal and next meal, but this has been a game changer for me, you guys. Just planning out the whole week in advance makes such a huge difference. I am really flexible with it, though. I'm not super, like, strict. As you can see, I'm kind of deviating from the plan, but I have an overall idea of what I can eat, what, thing, what certain things are worth, like, point-wise. So... As you can see, I've got avocado toast there, but that's without bacon. So when I add bacon to it, I know that that is seven points. And I do that when I've got a little bit of wiggle room. So yeah, that is what I'm going to eat. And like I said, I will check back in with you guys when it is time to eat again. <laughs> oh, and little update on water. I'm kind of behind on water, so I need to catch up um, on water for sure. So hopefully next time I check in with you guys, you guys will see this um, further down here <laughs> or something but yeah so that's where we're at I'll uh, check back in with you guys in a little bit okay guys I am in between appointments it has been a crazy crazy work day so I'm just gonna walk you through this really quickly because I only have about 15 minutes to eat before my next appointment so this is Trader Joe's reduced guilt mac and cheese mixed with blackened chicken from Tyson 
and a whole bunch of broccoli, like a ton of broccoli. So this is eight points total. The chicken is zero points. The broccoli is zero points. And then the mac and cheese is eight points. So eight points there. And then I also have some apples I'm going to have on the side. And then I also have a Diet Mountain Dew, a little caffeine pick-me-up. And then as far as water is concerned, let's see, it is right now 2 o'clock on the dot. So I'm actually doing pretty good with water. I can definitely get down to the 4 o'clock mark here pretty soon because I think in my actual water cup I have, it's like halfway gone. So I'm doing pretty good with water. I definitely need to stay on top of it to make sure I get in my full gallon today. Sorry for, <laughs> I haven't cleaned up my dishes yet. Just realized that. Sorry about that. But yeah, so that is where we are at for lunch. I, I think I said earlier I was going to have a snack. I'm actually pretty hungry, so I'm just going to make some adjustments. This is eight points. My breakfast was seven points. I get 19 points for the day, so I'll have four points remaining. I had planned on putting a full portion of cheese and tortillas tortilla chips with my dinner but I'm just going to adjust that a little bit to make some wiggle room and then I think I also still have some weeklies I can tap into if I want to so yeah that is where we are at so I will check in with you guys at dinner time and after dinner I will share you know the total point breakdown and everything and just share how the day went overall but I'm going to eat and get back to work. All right, so it is now six o'clock. I'm on my little hour and a half work break to eat some dinner and go for a walk and all that good stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys what I am eating and I may, I might have a little like sweet treat a little bit later, so I'll show that to you guys in a little bit. I'm gonna flip you around and show you what is for. Okay, so here's dinner. This is white chicken chili by the Skinny-ish Dish. I'll have the recipe linked down below for you guys. And then I've got two servings of the tortilla strips, tri-color tortilla strips for two points. The soup itself is two points, so four points total. I've got some tapatio on here, some hot sauce, and then I also have some diced um, tomatoes on here as well. So that is what I'm having for dinner. I'm also going to have a can of Diet Dr. Pepper. And then yeah, I'll check back in with you guys a little bit later after dinner and let you know how the day ended up. All right guys, it is time to end the night. This has been a crazy, crazy day. I am ready to just cozy up and read and go to bed. But I wanted to show you guys my little sweet treat for the evening and give you a water update, um, which I need to pour myself a glass right now actually so I can show you more accurately what the water situation is looking like so let's see if I can do this without spilling sorry for the lighting by the way my office it's nighttime and okay there we go that'll be more accurate but water's looking good so <sighs> what a day what a day <laughs> what a day <laughs> oh gosh okay I feel like it's just been a really stressful day, so sorry guys if I seem on edge, but I am just, ooh. Anyways, okay. So I'm having a little sweet treat to end the night. We had dinner, we went for a walk and everything, which was great. So water-wise, I just filled up my glass. These are from Target, it's just a basic pink glass. And then as you'll see, so that cup is full and then I have my jug at the eight, a little underneath the eight o'clock mark. So that's like one more glass of water. And it's a it's like 8.30 now. So I just need to drink that full glass and the rest of that jug. And then I'll get in my gallon for the day, which I know I can do. So that's great. And then I'll show you the sweet treat I'm having and I'll show you like how I ended the day point wise and all that good stuff. Okay, so this beauty <laughs> is a fiber one brownie, chocolate fudge brownie topped with two tablespoons of light Cool Whip and a gram of rainbow sprinkles. So this is, I just forgot. So the brownie's two points and the sprinkles are zero. A teaspoon of sprinkles are one point and that's like a quarter of a teaspoon. So I just don't count points 
for it. Um, and then the Cool Whip is one point, so it's three points in total for that little sweet treat. That is how I'm ending the day. So I've got nine weekly points remaining. Um, I had a blue dot day Saturday. Sunday was Mother's Day, so I ended up going over my points that day. But yeah, I've got nine weekly points remaining. I used 22 today, which is still in my blue dot range. And so there's the breakfast, lunch, dinner, and then my little brownie. And I don't remember how many ounces are in a gallon. I wanna say, let's see, let me Google. How many ounce in a gallon? Let's see what it says. 128. So water wise, I have probably hit like around that mark. So quite a bit of water, which is great. But yeah, so that's how I'm ending the night. Gonna have this little sweet treat. These little brownies, by the way, are best if you microwave them and um, or heat them up in the microwave for 15 seconds. I swear, it makes them so much better. Trust me, try it. And then I like doing the Cool Whip because it's almost like having ice cream on top, but for way less points. And then the sprinkles are just like, you know, who doesn't love sprinkles? <laughs> that is how I am ending the day. So I hope you guys enjoyed this what I eat in a day video. I really love sharing this just because I personally love watching these types of videos. I just find them to be really helpful to get like meal ideas and things like that. So I hope that you guys find it to be helpful as well. Um, any recipes I use today will be link down below um, in the description box too. And if you're interested in signing up for Weight Watchers, I do have a link in the description box down below that you can use to get a free month, which is awesome. So definitely check out that link. Other than that, you guys, that is it for this video. I am going to eat this and edit this video, get it up and ready for you guys. I'm filming it Monday night. It's going up tomorrow. <laughs> so I gotta get that done tonight. Um, and then I'm gonna read and go to bed, so. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful week and I will chat with y'all later. Bye.